This is SAT test 5, calculator question number 36. College Board gives us a circle with some odd angles drawn in it and asks if P is the center of the circle, what is the value of angle X, given that this angle is 20 and this angle is 20? There are some obscure theorems you may have seen in geometry, but if you're watching this video, you probably aren't using those, and I don't want to use them anyways. To solve this, I'm going to draw one more line from A to P, and the length of that line is the radius of the circle, which is also the length of P to B. So I have an isosceles triangle with two sides equal, which means two angles are equal. These are both 20 degrees. If those are 20 and 20, the third angle adds up to 180. So 20 plus 20 plus x equals 180. x equals 140 degrees. This angle down here is also 140 degrees. And these two angles plus x add to 360. 140 plus 140 is 280. x equals 80 degrees. And the picture does not say not to scale, so we can assume that it is to scale. And in the picture, this looks slightly less than a right angle, so 80 degrees is plausible. And they are, in fact, asking for the value of x, the angle in degrees, so I have answered the question they're asking. I always like to check that I'm asking the question they answer, because often when I finish the math, I don't have the answer to their actual question, but in this case, I do. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.